Hello, warm greetings and welcome to another Real Ale Up North beer review. Today we have for you, from north of the border, a nice crisp pale ale, Chieftain Pale Ale from the Williams Brothers. They make some mighty fine beers, do Williams Brothers. I've had quite a few on draft and this is their bottle version of Chieftain Pale Hale Ale. So what we're going to expect from this, I'm thinking nice, crisp, refreshing brew. Let's uh, see, let's uh, crack it open, let's find out. The warmer nights, the warmer days are coming, the warmer temperatures, you're thinking of beer gardens and nice sunny long afternoons and the Chieftain Pale Ale will probably, perhaps, go down very well indeed. So let's uh, have a look at this this brew as we just pour into the glass. Nice head forming there, a nice bit of lacing. Let's have a look at the colour. The colour, well, let's say a pale, a pale golden colour, would you think? Very, uh, quite well carbonated. You can see all the bubbles are rising to, to the head there. Not a bad lacing for this Chieftain Pale Ale. Let's have a snifter. Let's see what we've got for you. Yeah, nice, refreshing, zesty aroma, as one would expect from uh, a pale ale. Yeah, quite fruity, citrusy. Yeah, I think, uh, I think I'm going to enjoy this. I think this is going to be a nice refresher, a nice crisp one to enjoy. Whoa. Yeah, it's a very refreshing, crisp, a nice, gassy, refreshing mouthfeel as one would expect uh, with a pale ale. A little sweet, tad sweet I would think, it's quite nice. Fruity, as I said citrusy, lemony maybe, just uh, have, another, have another slurp. Yeah it's very well carbonated, you'll probably still see the bubbles that are rising from this uh, light golden <coughs> pale ale. This is a nice refresher, a nice refreshing brew, citrusy, as I said, quite well carbonated, as you'd expect, it's refreshing, it's citrusy, it's gassy, but it's crisp and it's very, very nice indeed. Yeah, one you'd like to, one you'd like to drink in the beer garden, your own garden in fact, or your own backyard or wherever, even in the market square when you've just bought it, if the uh, Plastic police and all about like right? you know just have a, a sneaky sneaky brew, but this is a nice crisp ale. I like this one. Yeah, nice, very nice, gassy, refreshing mouth mouthfeel. As I said, it'd be ideal for the coming warm summer days, summer afternoons. Nice bit of floral about it, so. A little, a little flowery maybe, but uh, it's citrusy, it's refreshing, it's a nice crisp pale ale. What you'd expect from something, it was the, uh, just forgetting the actual uh, volume, it was 4%, 4% this pale ale, so a nice easy drinking ale, pale ale for you, and uh, yeah, I quite like this, uh, this ale, the lacing's still there for you, so I'm going to slurp, dive in again. Yes, Williams Brothers, that's a pretty nice beer. A nice, crisp, dry aftertaste, a nice feel in the mouth. Yeah, pretty crisp, citrusy, dry finish. What you'd expect from a pale ale, a Chieftain Pale Ale from Williams Brothers at 4%. Marks out of 10, that's a pretty good beer. Pretty crisp, pretty refreshing, as I said, I'd give that. I think I'd give that an 8. I've quite enjoyed that beer. It's been a nice sunny day today, so it's gone down particularly well as this pale ale. A very nice crisp beer. As you can see it's quite gassy, excuse moi. But uh, yeah, that's a very nice beer. A nice light golden crisp pale ale from Williams Brothers. A Chieftain pale ale to enjoy for you. Very nice indeed. Seven and a half. Eight out of ten. Yeah, I like that one. Okey doke. 
thumbs up for that one, I would think. That's about it from me. A fond farewell. And as always, enjoy your beer.